Hello everyone, and welcome to the Town of Light. Today, I'm going to be playing the demo for the spooky month of October. Um, okay, just the brightness is at all is barely visible. Let's just brighten up a little bit more. Make sure everybody can see what the heck's going on in this game. Because usually when you're viewing a like a horror game, it's a little too dark. Ooh. Town of Life is based on real events, places of research concerning mental illnesses, and the life of patients in a lunatic asylum for the beginning of the 20th century. It contains stories which may be disturbing, characters' and names are fictitious, the game uses artistic interpretation, of a former Italian psychiatric institution. Please note that mental health services radically improved. Oh god. It's gonna be real bad. Like, they treated mental health patients terribly back in the days. What's happened? What is this place? I don't know. All I see is black. Maybe I'm dead. I can't see any light. Maybe I am dead. Mm. I can't get up. What's going on? What's happening to so me? So I'm not moving it right now. Still cutscene. There's no one here. But these noises. God, my head is killing me. I can't keep my eyes open. You've been drugged. Reality fades away, and my skin has gone. Every breath of wind is excruciatingly painful. Facts. Yeah, so I'm just playing the demo right now. I don't know if I'll actually play the full game. We'll see how it goes. Um, but I think it's like roughly half an hour long or so, give or take. So we'll see. I, I saw this on the Xbox. Um store as a demo and I was like why not just try it out okay ooh this Tuscany ooh this doesn't seem spooky that's good open close and use oh in here can I can I run doesn't seem like it. I think I'm just stuck perpetually walking toggle flash oh god flashlight mechanics already some bottles more bottles Ooh, what's in the fridge Julia K. distressed but held up by her faith. Her mother, Irene, father, and sister delivered the grievous news. The funeral takes place. Blah, 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 blah. First food rationing improvements. Incredible anti-aircraft victory. So this is fierce murder. Blah, 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 blah. Anything? No. Where's the pizza? Okay, so I got flashlight and I got, oh, can I take the shovel? I mean, I guess I'd have no use for it, but like, what if I need to smash someone's head in? No crouching. Oh, here we go. So why is like a menu kind of backpack thing? Ooh. be stuck walking. Ooh. Guess this is the place. Oh 
racing crews and everyone in between. <gasps> the gate fell. Spooks. Oh wow, isn't that convenient? The gate fell to allow us towards this giant this creepy building. Time. Memory. Words. Banana. Claustrophobia. Ooh, my controller shook. Those spooky controller vibrations. It little girl and more doors and view the town. Telegram, please kindly notify any relatives of death of blank, inviting them to cover really expensive failing which corpse would be sent to blah 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 died like how the, that's the only word that I focused on in that telegram just died there's no power the master switch is near the calm woman ward Okay, so I'm here. Administrative waiting stairs, conference visitors, tranquil ward, observation ward, rosary twist, twist, nurses, wait, what? Calm woman ward. Which one's the calm woman ward? I guess the tranquil ward? Ooh, I cannot. Can I zoom? Okay. So, to the left. Fascist National Federation for the fight against tuberculosis. Yeah, fuck you, tuberculosis. We're gonna kick your ass. Hello? Patient discharge stuff. Added to synopsis menu. Province of Rome, death report of Ida. Um, woman in a state of great agitation. She curses her three year old daughter for having ruined her life. Ooh, that's. The only thing I remember clearly is Charlotte, my doll. Oh. You. Okay. Lights on! Woo! So, hmm. Now what? Grounds, park, nurses' room, toilets, toilets, refectory, refectory, dudes. <clears throat> Where am I supposed to go? I guess I just explore. Toilets always a good place to explore. This door is tiny. Toilets. Lock. Okay. Hmm. 
No, no, she's freezing. She's alone. Let's look for her. Renee doesn't want to abandon her. Okay, so I think we're looking for my doll. Before I go anywhere else. This game has noises very quiet. Except for the footsteps. Your footsteps are so much louder compared to everything else. I'm waiting for something scary to pop up. Okay. We keep going. Nobody says we can't. Let's find Charlotte. Let's find Charlotte. She's alone. She's alone in the dark. So she's, she's somewhere here. Unless I have to- Let's search the wards on the upper floor. There's a plan on the wall which shows their location. Okay. Let's start this way. Charlotte, where art thou, Charlotte? Renee doesn't want to abandon her. Okay, I get it, Renee. Fuck. Oh god, she's creepy. Mummy took good care of Charlotte. She tucked her in, hugged her, gave her cuddles and kisses. She was very affectionate and loving. Nothing bad happened to Charlotte, and that surprised me. I didn't understand. At first, I was quite scared. I was afraid that she wanted to hurt me. Who, Charlotte or Mom? I lived in constant fear that Mom would abandon her. Because I didn't deserve to live. I didn't deserve to be loved. Ooh. It's cold and it's dark. Look, she's cold. She'll get ill. We can take care of her. Nobody can stop us. Charlotte is a good girl. Uh huh. Ooh, it's a mouth. Well, now what? Oh, wow. That's neato. I can't open this door. Okay, let me try going my synopsis thing. I see stuff I I get a Oh fuck. Oh. Okay. I 
Um, game does not give you a lot of direction on what you're supposed to do. Oh my god. Wait, keys. Can I can't pick up the key. Are you no, I don't. Find it odd and I can't pick up the keys, but okay. I don't know what I'm doing. But this game is poopy. He'll get angry. I know he'll get angry. Okay. You're just exploring where you're supposed to go next. Like, it doesn't give you any clues. He doesn't want to. No. In the town of light, he doesn't want to. Charlotte is cold. I saw a wheelchair. Let's take her somewhere warm. warm. It's comfortable. What? What? I saw a wheelchair on the ground floor. It's comfortable there, and we could put Charlotte somewhere warm. Okay. Sure. Aha. I was about to say, where did we see a wheelchair? Literally, it was here two seconds ago. Charlotte will be comfy here. But it's cold. No, no, it's cold. Don't shiver, Charlotte. The cold will go away. It'll go away. Your face looks all messed up, Charlotte. Oh, let me just phase behind the wheelchair. We must find some warm lights. Let's go to the surgical ward. Surgical ward. Um. Is this the surgical ward? He doesn't want to. Not Charlotte. Okay, that's not a surgical ward. It's a surgical ward. Administrative waiting. Three is blank. Stairs, conference, visitors, tranquil ward, observation ward, refractory, fluttery, to the. Hmm. Maybe we have to bring Cheryl upstairs. Maybe that's where the surgical ward is. <clears throat> Pull a unique. Okay, you stay there, Cheryl. I'll, I'll get the elevator for you. Don't worry. Fun fact, um, I have a fear of elevators. Oh, oh fuck, man. No, let go, okay. 
Oh, shit, I got- Oh, sorry, I gotta manually close the door. Here we go. Here we go. Um, okay. Yep. Just elevator. Just elevator. Charlotte. Okay. Stairs. <clears throat> Zoom in a bit. Uh, gynecology did it surgery seven. Come on, Charlotte. We're going to fix up your ugly ass face. Party. Real party. Good. Are you serious? Charlotte, what are you stuck on? God damn it. Can I? Oh, is there rubble? Can I not get over there? I don't know if I can actually bring her to surgeries. No, I can't. I'm so confused. He'll get angry. I know he'll get angry. <sighs> Can I take her in here? Does count? The cold has gone away now. You see? The okay. light. The warmth. We can do it. The cold will go away. It has to. Now we can enter the ward where everything started. It all began in the observation ward on the ground floor. Do I have a, a hint system now that'll help me? Cause like... Oops, he's wrong one. Um, observation aid. Oh, so yeah, now it comes out with a hint system. Oof. Yeah, I 
I, I really don't think this is up to code, to be honest. But what do I know? I'm not an architect. Ooh, this is bright. I apologize. I cannot see a thing just like you guys. still moving just very slowly help, but I couldn't speak I was Ooh. terrified of everything even thinking they said they were taking me to a place where the fear would go away where I would get better they lied I stopped living in there they dragged me away and stripped off all my clothes. Everything. I tried to explain what was going on in my head. They tied me to the bed. For days. Yeah. I was alone with my nightmares. It wasn't fear anymore. It was madness. And when you're mad... You cease to exist. Yeah, from my knowledge, they just basically, like, treat them as prisoners. Just locked them up. Instead of actually helping people with mental health issues, they just kind of... didn't do anything. She was my only hope in this hell. I was descending down, down among the damned. Hi. And, and her smile kept me alive. No, my best friend, Jody. Chapter, chapter three. The door is locked from the outside. Cool. Here, the doors can only be locked and unlocked from the outside. Okay. Okay, so we somehow got a locked in this room and as you could clearly hear, someone unlocked it. Proceed to run down the hallway. They ran to my right. I'm going to the right. It's probably a bad idea. Oh, fuck. That's the end of the demo. My name is Renee. I was a shy girl and I just wanted to be like the others. Mm -hmm. But that's not what happened.
maybe not. We're growing so weird and close when looking for ourselves. A lot of people were mistreated. Time is demo but I don't know if I'll actually play the game full on um, if you guys want me to tell me in the comments or um, let, let the bouncy castle crew know and I might pick up the full game but yeah this was the demo um, so I hope you enjoyed